Welcome back to the channel, guys. Thanks for tuning in to another episode. Hey, you know, it was a week or two ago that we put out a pretty somber episode about an accident that had happened here on the Fox River right by our house that Megan and I witnessed. And that got some talk going about boater safety and things like that based on what we did, that episode that we did. And I want to talk about a new product that's available that can not only help you catch more fish, but can also help you be safer when you're out on the water. So stick around and we'll talk more about this when we come back. Welcome back to Mark Fisher Outdoors, everybody. I'm Mark Fisher. So like I said, we were talking about this accident that happened a week or two ago here on the Fox River. And a, a bunch of buddies and I were talking about just different things that we do when it comes to boater safety. Do we wear a life jacket all the time? Even when, you know, obviously we wear a life jacket when the big motor's running, if we're in a tournament and things like that. I wear a life jacket anytime the big motor's running. Um, but do you wear a life jacket when you're up on deck fishing or not, or only based on certain conditions? Um, you know, do you wear an inflatable life jacket versus a full size life jacket? All of those were safety questions that me and some buddies were just talking about, uh, you know, just in relation to that accident and the way things happen and the way you have to kind of be careful. Uh, well, one of the things that I've just recently learned about, and I've had this for a long time, it's the Deep Dive app that I've had for, gosh, going on a year and a half now, but I've always had it from a standpoint of helping me when it comes to fishing. The Deep Dive app gives you tons of information, it gives you weather information, it gives you water clarity information, it gives you fishing tips, you know, things that have worked in the past at that time of year on that particular lake gives you, you know, fishing, solar, solar lunar tables and, you know, when the best fishing periods are and, and all of those. Well, one of the things that the deep dive app has always given you is the wind direction. So you can see where the wind blown banks are and obviously those are typically better fishing areas. But one of the things that the Deep Dive app has now done where it's even more sophisticated than it was in the past is it is now showing what the wave action is like based on the wind direction. And in essence, what it's showing you is where are the calm waters that you can travel especially days like today, windy, cold days where the water temperatures are really cold and you don't want to be in a situation where you're risking riding through heavy waves and things like that. And you can, you can use this app to literally find the seams in a lake where the wind will not be blowing as hard and where you can boat safely to get from one point to another. As you're seeing here, I've got the, uh, I just picked a lake on the Fox Channel Lakes. This is Grass Lake. And I just pulled it up today. And this is what the wind is looking like here today. And boy, I tell you what, today would not be a day that I would wanna end up in the water. Even with a life jacket, that water temperature is gonna be cold and things like that. So if I'm looking at traveling across Grass Lake, I can look at taking this path across Grass Lake and know that I'm not gonna encounter heavy waves because the waves are marked with this indication. You can see the windblown bank, but you can also see the protected bank and you can see what path it would be safest for you to take your boat and travel without any risk of you know, getting dumped in. Now, again, if you had a bass boat, you're probably going to be okay either way. But if you were, if you were in a smaller John boat or something like that, 
this gives you that information to be a little bit safer when you're on the water. In addition to all the great fishing information that this app gives you. I think the Deep Dive app is a phenomenal app, even if you were just to tell me that you use it, you know, to gather fishing information. But now when you have this little added component to the Deep Dive app, I think it's a great thing to add from a safety standpoint as well. So I'd highly encourage you, take a look, go on the, uh, go to the app store, look at the, at the Deep Dive app and consider subscribing and getting yourself uh, that Deep Dive app on your phone. And that way you have it with you every time you go on the water or any day prior to getting on the water, you can take a look at what those conditions are gonna be for your fishing day. Guys, we hope you appreciate this content. If you do, please hit that like and subscribe button. We appreciate you being a part of the Mark Fisher Outdoors community, and we will see you again tomorrow for another episode. Take care, everybody.